Your what? Be a prat. What is that? Explain. Job is witness. Okay. So, what what exactly you guys believe? Oh, let's say, are, do you do you hold firm to the Jehovah's Witness? Hmm? Do you hold firm to the Jehovah's Witness belief, or is it just something you were raised? As best I can, I follow my strides. The relationship with Jehovah God is all about your attentiveness to your strides and your placement in life and your truth of projection and your progress. And your attentiveness to his rulership and his provisions. So as a Jehovah Witness, uh, what, what do you have to do to be saved? Attain to the intricacies of Jehovah God's allowances. So you have to follow the commandments in order to be saved, is that what you're saying? Do you believe in the Bible? Yes. But so, the Bible says the opposite of that. It says you don't actually have to follow the, the, the law in order to be saved. It's only by faith. No. Second, second, uh, by second. Faith, by faith, by faith, we achieve the understandings and wisdom for necessary to accomplish the law. We the Ephesians. Law is, the law is just as a structure as well, everything and, that will keep. But if, um, if, if your, you believe that the scriptures are uh, the authority, then Ephesians 2.18 says it's by grace through faith that a man is saved. It's not by following the law. By grace through faith. So right. if you if you were given a path, if Jesus Christ as the provider of faith showed you a path to, to, to make strides upon and you weren't graceful upon them. So but, as to but say, grace is a gift. Grace can be the way you achieve your forward motion. But grace is a grace it's is a gift. Not, grace is and your forward and your forward motion is most definitely a gift because it's just as much as a blessing as whether you had corns or long toenails so, or cows. So on is your it feet. you who's actually earning salvation or is it God that gave you salvation? Salvation Right, to be saved, to get to heaven. We're talking salvation, about salvation. Salvation is a salvation is a subject of its own because we can't we can't understand our salvation until Jehovah God has it. Until God has salvation, I don't understand. Until Jehovah God is recognized as for as I good for all that He has provided, for all that He allows us to what does it say that in the Bible in existence? But you know where it says that in the Bible. I don't, I don't, I lost my phone and... My hey, can I share this with you, brother? Is that okay if I share you, share with you a scripture? Book of Romans? Okay. I'm not trying to argue with you. You know, I, I, I just want to share it with you, if, if you're open to it, about, you know, faith and works. You know, I, I believe, I believe it's part of salvation, right? But when it comes to salvation and being sealed with the Holy Spirit... Uh, it says here in Ephesians chapter 4, For Abraham were justified by works, he hath were up to glory, but not before God. Okay? So Abraham had glory, but not before God, because of all his works. When we and, do works, and we're glory. And similarly, I said that we can't have our own salvation yeah. until Jehovah God has his salvation. Yeah. That's the, okay. same, that's the same thing that's being spoken right there. Isn't Abraham... That? Made his made his accomplishments of stride. He was given before Jehovah God. Let me so share this for with you, us to let me continue to share this with you. Uh, for what saith the Scripture? Abraham believed God, and it was counted unto him for righteousness. Right now, to him that worketh in the reward not reckoned of grace, but of debt. But to him that worketh not. But believeth on him that justifies the ungodly. He has faith that's counted for righteousness. So this is talking about someone that does no works, but believes on the Lord Jesus Christ. That person is is saved. We're saved by faith. That's what it says. Mm -hmm. For to him that worketh not, does no works, but believeth on him that justifies the ungodly. Who justifies the ungodly? Jesus, right? Down across our sins. His faith is counted for righteousness. So the Word of God says in this scripture, similar to what you're saying, what you were saying earlier, but also 
going forward is it's saying that we're saved of faith and not of works. Um, when when you consider someone who what who doesn't work nowadays, what is what are the first things that are to be considered? Well, let's it define be, works. Well, what do you think about? Well, this I'm just saying in general. Yeah. When, when when we say works, what are usually the um, qualifications? Someone either isn't meeting the knowledgeable requirements to maintain that work or fulfill yeah. that work, mm -hmm. um, which can be mental or physical, mm -hmm. lame or um, just not enough understanding. Those are those are ways that a person could be justified ungodly because they're not meeting a percentage wide, like point of like physical works um, right? perfection like because when the real problem is when people dwell in degradation and um, immerse themselves in it so much that that's the manifestations and love of life that they um, put out daily so trying to um, see someone trying to see someone progress you you have to take into account that it's just with mental health with mental health issues you may yeah. have a judge tell you you're under God obligation to be under observation yeah seven years so that would that would that would make you unqualified to be in what do you active think hold on for a second. okay go ahead that would make you unqualified to be in in in, in active service not a, a literally lame if you have the mental health infractions but just for the observation because you'd be putting your, you'd be putting questions on whether Jehovah God is really moving you structurally sound through life I believe in that brother you know I, I believe I believe Jehovah God I believe I believe in God the Father you know and uh, I believe the Bible calls Jesus as, as Jehovah that is the name of God um, but w when it, when it comes to salvation right what qualifies a person to be saved uh, could I share with you another scripture is that okay no thank you I'm sorry no all right brother well you have a good day okay okay thanks for sharing God bless you have a good day yeah thank man. you